hey hey family it is your girl Evelyn here and I'm back with another video and I'm not really talking about self-care in this video I mean maybe a form of self-care but I'm kind of talking more about business and more specifically uh, just want to share with you uh, an experience that I just finished having so I'm getting ready to go out of town on vacation I actually leave tomorrow but by the time you're watching this video I will either be on vacation or on my way back from vacation and um, so one of my friends was out of town working with a client and she was like hey you know if you want to come over and hang out at my apartment just for a change of scenery you can do this so I was like okay you know I'll pack up my stuff for a few days and I'll go over to her place and kind of apartment sit right and so um, it's interesting because I went and all of a sudden I felt like I was on an impromptu workcation I just felt so energized to work, 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 work. I cannot sing. That is not my ministry. Anyway, let me get back to the point. Um, and so I was like, I've always wanted to do a workcation, but I had never done it. I always wanted to do either a staycation or a um, traveling workcation, right? Just like I do, you know, personal treats. I always wanted to do it. And so um, I was like, you know what? Let's, let's, let's do this. So I hadn't planned it. I had pl still planned on like going to the gym and running all these errands. But I was like, no, let's go to the grocery store. Let's cook up something good and let's have several days of a workation. And so I just kind of want to share with you kind of like what my experience was um, and what happened during that time. I think one of the biggest things was that it was uninterrupted time that and not even just external interruptions but the fact that there was nothing for me to get into like when you work from home or you're in your home office or at your kitchen table or your dining room table or wherever you can always get up and load the dishwasher you can always throw a load of laundry in you can always you know be in and out of the fridge you can always you know want to clean your room or clean your bathroom or clean the living room you know you always see something you want to organize you know you you just you can get easily distracted and um sometimes even if you go to like a co-working space or a coffee shop or something like that that's great because you don't get as distracted but eventually you know you have to stop your day and then transition back into reality i think what was great about this workation is that I could just keep going now I don't want to do that as a lifestyle right like I don't want to work like that all the time but it was fantastic just for a couple of days to just be able to you know get up have my prayer my devotion time eat and then just get a lot of things done relax in the evening with a movie you know not have to change locations and then do it the next day so I was I think I did a workation for about two to three days I was there longer than that but like of those kind of like working days and I I, I got so much done I felt I feel more ahead than I have felt in a really really long time and I was like oh I need to do this once a quarter like that and that feeling of being ahead has significantly reduced my stress level um, because you know if you watch in a previous video um, I talk about Marie Kondoing your business I think that video is gonna come out before this one and just how I was doing the most I was team too much I was doing the most and how that was causing stress and so I think after Marie Kondoing my business to come behind that with a workation and then follow it up with a vacation bomb okay bomb 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 so um, I love that I think the other thing that was really fantastic about it is it allowed me the time to finish things that are extended in nature. I think typically when I have things to do that, you know, I know are going to take a really long time, I'm cutting it into pieces. And that, I mean, that's how do you, how do you eat an elephant, you know, one bite at a time, right? But I think the beauty of this workation was that I was able to do some things to completion. And that sense of being, it being completed was like, if you're a list person like I am, you know to cross something off of your list, particularly something that is, you know, um, very involved was like a breath of fresh air. Like it was so, huh? okay, so, and I'm looking, I, I did make some notes. Like I don't have a bullet pointed list, but I made some notes because I didn't want to forget because I'm filming a lot of videos since I'm going on vacation right now. And I was like, my thoughts could be all over the place. So, um, uh, so reducing stress, extended um, time to complete tasks, also uninterrupted time. I think it also 
allow me to be way more strategic than I normally am. And I think like to think that I'm super strategic, but this allowed me to be uber strategic. And so I think I want to do this like once a quarter or at least three times a year just to really um, give myself the chance, like particularly if I did it quarterly, to get ahead for the quarter and then kind of, co not coast, but you know, work at a, at a nice level and then do it again just to knock out some of those really big milestones that you, you know, the, the goals and things that you have for yourself. It felt fantastic. Um, and I think the other thing was I didn't have a schedule. So I had packed my gym clothes and I just, you know, I just wasn't feeling it. I think, um, y'all know I work out 45 days a week. Maybe you don't know that. I work out 45 days a week. And so sometimes, like, you know, getting up and that coming first, I while I, I love the way I feel when I finish the gym and I'm, you know, I'm glad that I can check it off the list and I'm taking care of my body. Sometimes I, I just want to get up and work. Like I want to get up, I want to do my devotion and I want to work. And this has really allowed me to do that so um yeah it's been really really good i you know one of the things i've always wanted to do was to do a workcation with other people let me know if that was if y'all would like for those of you who are in business if you would love like to get together at a remote location or a resort or something like that and do like a workcation like i i i would love it so um that sounds like so much fun anyway let me know and uh yeah y'all make sure you follow me on instagram at the evelyn inc and on facebook and uh yeah so that was my experience so i just want to share with you a couple of things that i think will uh, if you decide to do a a a workation would be beneficial i kind of did my impromptu but i think here's a couple of things that would be helpful i think number one is have a list of things that you would like to complete and don't beat yourself up if you don't complete them all i didn't complete all of the things that i wanted to complete but i completed a lot of things so have a list of things that you want to complete um have some quiet time sometimes i had music on sometimes i didn't but have some quiet time buy plenty of food so that you don't have to leave um the place that you're at or if you're at a hotel do room service things like that um get a lot of rest i stayed up late but i also didn't set an alarm okay and um i let go of i have to get this done this day i was like i've got three days to get as much done as i want to get done it wasn't stressful i just kind of let it flow right and i allowed my creativity flow and it was so fantastic so Anyway, with that being said, uh, I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Facebook at The Evelyn Inc. And uh, let me know in the comments if you would be interested. Like, let's we could do a workation together, girl. Okay? All right. Talk to you soon.